Hey everybody, welcome to another Snufflepile video. And in this video, uh, I'm going to show you how you can uh, add text beside the uh, mobile menu or the hamburger uh, menu item in Elementor Pro, this nav menu at a, a widget. Uh, because by default, uh, you don't get one. You just basically get this. Uh, you get the hamburger icon and that now most people, well, that's being editorial. Some people don't know what that is and it's nice to have it like this where you can say my menu and this comes from uh, the uh, Astra theme where you can actually add that in the uh, theme customizer. But you don't have that option in uh, Elementor Pro's nav menu. So we're going to go and add that with some simple CSS. So basically what I've done, uh, I just created, here we are, test five page just the uh, basic nav menu item I didn't make anything aside and we said it was the hamburger and there's no option here to have the text maybe they'll add that at some other point but they haven't yet and if you'll notice that let me just show you that again in case you miss it See this little panel down here? Well, you get that from granular controls. So go check out that plugin on the uh, WordPress plugin repository and install that and enable this function because it's so much handier than doing uh, this and then that. Plus you get to decide where you want it to go to. Anyways, so this is just a simple matter of CSS and I'm going to show you here in the plugins. Uh, all I've got here is simple CSS from Tom Osborne from Generate Press fame. And uh, so let's go put in the first batch of CSS. And this one is going to give you the name. I'm just going to go copy it here from my other monitor where I have no bad plus plus running. Paste that in, and this is the uh, selector for the menu in uh, Elementor's nav, and we're going to say before, and here is where you can change the text, and I just put menu, okay? So we're going to save that, come over here, and refresh, and there we are. Menu, just like that. Now, what you can do is, instead of saying before, you could say after. And where do you think that's going to happen? Come over here, refresh, and there it's after. But then you'd have to adjust the other values. So I'm just going to leave that before, because it makes more sense in my mind. Now, something else you might like to do is maybe change the color of that text. So uh, let's just add some color. And I'm just going to use the uh, text version of the colors, even just so we can see what's going on. And add red. Now let's go take a look. Refresh. There we are. Ah, looking good. Okay, but let's say I want to have the uh, the bars red as well. Okay, well, we can do that. We need some uh, uh, more CSS for that. So we'll just go and paste that in here. Now, this is just for the element itself. And color red. And I'm not going to have that in there yet. Let me just take that out. Save it. Refresh. Now you see you've got that. Okay, so paste that back in. 
So we're going to have a background color. Let's go see what that looks like. Of gold. And there you go. And say, well, I don't want any color. Well, I just want the text. Well, that's no problem. Just come over here and say transparent for the color. Save. Back over here. Refresh. And there you go. And you say, well, I want that blue. The blue looks nice. Okay, change the color of the text. Refresh. Now it's blue. And then you'd have to change the color for this to blue as well. Uh, for the bars. And you want to say, my cool menu. Change the text for the content. Save the CSS. Come back over. Refresh. My cool menu. And there we go. So that's how you can uh, style the Elementor Pro nav menu uh, mobile uh, indicator or a hamburger menu. Okay. Well, I hope that uh, kind of helped you out for that sort of thing. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to Sniffle Valve right here on the Sniffle Valve site, as well as on the YouTube channel. And uh, don't worry, all this... Uh, CSS will be provided uh, on the Sniffle Valve site, uh, a link to which will be in the description on the video. Okay, well, thank you for watching, and we'll see you again later.